Okay, great afternoon. Um, did a reading on Trump and what's going on with this uh, reporter that was killed in the Saudi embassy in Turkey. And, oh, what a surprise. First card I get out for, for Trump, his emotional thing with it. I won't cry for you. He's got no empathy. He's got no, you know, I w I'm not going to cry for you. Who are you? You're not even a citizen here. You're, you're nothing, okay? Nothing to me. Again, what we have under here is he's just looking at his success he's got going with the Saudis. His money deals. He's really happy with it. He's happy with his Saudi connection and again what he's harvesting from it. You know, I'm just looking at the, the things that I've got coming from there. I'm not gonna cry for you. You're not a citizen. Who are who are you? I'm just looking at the money. Okay? It's all I care about is my money deals. Again, you know, going into it, we've got the card of truce. It's just like, you know, I, I'm not involved with it. Okay? Again, I'm really happy, the sun card yet again. I'm really more happy with my overseas trade, with my deals I've got with them. You know, I've got money deals with them. I'm really happy with that. I'm not concerned, you know. Not something I want to look at, not something I want to deal with. Could care less. Underneath of it again, we have, you know, he's wanting to uh, slice and dice and go forward with his judgments, you know, and all he sees is his victories, what he thinks are victories, um, as far as his uh, interaction with the Saudis, okay? He thinks, oh, I'm really here. I've gone forward, slice and dice. I'm really strong. Look at this. I've got, you know, this connection with them. Again, above it, the big emotional connection. He's got the emotional connection. Jared went over there, you know, and the, the rapid things that have changed, you know, information, whatever coming. But again, they're, they're like... Uh, temperate about it not hot not cold I'm just you know the information is coming out you know the information is coming out it's coming forward it's emotional in nature but he's like again I don't care I don't care I'm looking at my you know I'm looking at my uh connections there and the money I'm getting and stuff but coming out the other side of it he's going to get more and more pressure because more and more is being uncovered okay things are being uncovered and it's not going to be so easy for him to change the narrative although he wished he could just magically make it disappear because what we have is a swords of interference you know they did it they did it you know, it's being uncovered. They did it. And it doesn't matter how much he wants to make it disappear. It happened. Okay? It happened. So let's see what else we have with that. Oh, yeah, but he's Trump. But he's Trump. He's the star. He's Trump. <laughs> of course, it comes. It's all about Trump all about Trump okay so let's see yeah he's really heartbroken that he may have to you know he may have to finally say something sanctions and if we do that what am I gonna lose because it's about Trump. What, what, oh, he's worried about what he might lose. <coughs> if he actually has to stand up, which he might, 
because these things are coming out and we're on the world stage with this. Okay. And he's still looking for a way to spin it. But here it is. Poor little Donald Trump. He's just heartbroken because he may wind up having to give something up. Okay. Because of the um, worldview um, about the situation. Yeah. So um, let me see if we have anything else. He's a, this guy is just just beyond. Yeah, but again, he wants to, all he's thinking about is when they traveled there, when they went to Saudi, about the, strong, the strength they have together. Again, double card of strength. Oh, we can survive this. We can, you know, I, all I'm thinking about is my journey and and Kushner's journey there and just how strong that alliance is. You know, I'm not giving up. I don't want to give up anything. I don't want to lose anything. Why should I have to lose? Why should I have to lose anything? After all, again, the guy's not even a citizen. He's not even a citizen. Okay. This guy is just, he's got no... No compassion yet. No, all he sees is in his armor, with his club, I'm protected, and it's all about the money. All about the money. So, forget it. Trump is just, he's absolutely, yeah, absolutely crazy so the love card but you know you, this is like upside down he's got no love he's got no love anywhere he the only thing he loves is you know and it, you could say this card is about love love of money that's it love of money you know that has to do with his arms deals and this kind of stuff yeah his love of money and the arms deal he's got cooked up with the Saudis and the money he's going to make with it. But as far as this guy is concerned, he is just cold as ice. You know, this first card said it all. I'm not going to cry for you. Yeah. Could care less. Could care less. Oh man, we need to get this guy out of the White House. He is just really he's he's a narcissistic uh, psychopath, one hundred percent narcissistic psychopath. He's got no feeling for anyone, no empathy, no understanding. Uh, you know, the only thing he understands is money. And somebody that just blows smoke up his butt to tell him how fabulous it is. And they can play him endlessly because he has got absolutely no discernment. He's got no discernment. He's got nothing. Yeah, so I'm going to leave this here. That's a, that is such a sad state of affairs to see for somebody supposed to be the president of the of the United States, home of the free and the brave, and you know, it's supposed to be a light to the world. Not with this administration. Not only has it become a laughing stock, but it's become, you know, a place of just absolutely greed above all. It's the only thing you can see with this administration is greed for those that are in power, big money, um, corporations, but as far as people are concerned, doesn't have any kind of a feeling for people at all. So I'm going to leave this here. Thank you for tuning in. Hope you're having a good Friday. Okay. And we, all we can do is pray for those that have lost everything up there in this horrible tornado and 
tornadoes and uh, hurricane that just took place. Okay, so I'm going to leave this here for now.